Hey everybody, thank you for joining in. Uh, we're not doing any kind of review tonight. We're just like what it says down in the thumbnail down here. We're going to do for the Sustroming Challenge for Advocacy. And uh, what I mean by advocacy, it's going to not blowing smoke. Um, a couple weeks ago, if you had followed Nikki B over on her channel, she had done the Sustroming Challenge with a bunch of people. Dawn from Adore Elik was was one of them. Uh, Big Doc, there was a few of them anyways. I'm just going to set you up with the premise of the whole deal here. Um, they had done the challenge over there on this juice that Big Doc had made. And if y'all from my Vaporium or my Vape Shack, um, he's known. He's been on a bunch of people's shows as well. He's an excellent juice maker, but he made this juice, which is the Sestrumming juice. Now, a little background on the Sestrumming. Sestrumming is a Swedish fermented fish, which I believe is herring, and there's a history behind it. You guys can Google it, but it started out over 100 years ago or whatever. Um, there was a salt shortage, and they were figuring out a way to keep their fish from the, for the fishermen to without the fish actually rotting. So they used minimal amount of a brine mixture of a salt and whatever. And threw it into barrels and then had the herring sit into that so it wouldn't it would cause it to ferment but not rot so you can imagine the smell already to this day it is still being handled the same way it's a delicacy over in Sweden I guess um, I guess it's not allowed to be you know to have it you were to fly it on a plane because if the can has a tendency to blow open and then you, yeah, you just imagine um, also, some restaurants actually do still serve it. They only do it for one day, and it's usually an outdoor restaurant. Um, but it's only going to be for one day because of the smell in itself. Also, like I said, you can Google it. It's all, you know, all that information is there. But just run that through your head of what fermented fish is going to smell like. Well, that's what this juice is. Um, and like I said... Big Doc is the one that made this juice, so thank you, Doc, for making us all suffer. But anyways, I was asked to do this challenge, and at first I was like, no, I ain't, this ain't happening. I don't do fish. I was asked again, and I said, all right, I thought about it. The only way I am going to do it is if it's for a good cause. All right? If anybody knows that, I'll do something. I don't care. You know, it's all in for fun. But I want to help raise some money for all of us to help us all. So we here's something that we can all help each other to do. So right as it is right now, we have eight participants. Some of the rules that you have to have are, it's going to have to be a, uh, Doc will give the whole rules, but you got to have to have it set up to be at least a minimum of four volts. And all participants have to take at least 10 pulls for this challenge. Okay, now we're kind of caught up to where we're at. We have eight participants right now. You know what the stuff is. So when I had mentioned this on last Friday night's show that we were talking about doing it to raise money for not blowing smoke, Don from Midori Liquid right away donated a hundred dollars. I had and if you were watching on Nikki's show, I made a I showed a copy of it. I'll show it again during the show. Um, but she donated a hundred dollars to not blowing smoke. Shane from Vape and Swag donated $100 for not blowing smoke. Brent from Island Vapes donated $50 for not blowing, to not blowing smoke. So there's $250 that we had already that's going to not blowing smoke, which is already there. So that kind of started the wheels in turning. So here's the list of participants, and then I'm going to go down with the rest of the, some of the other inners. I know it's kind of a little bit, but I just want to get you guys in a, you know, build it up a little bit. Also let you know, and I want you guys to share this around because I want to get as many people as we can so we can raise more money. And that's really what it's all about. It's to help us help one another. Um, so the participants that we have are me, Nikki B, let me get that, Chris Cullen from Cullen Vape Re Midwest Vape Reviews, um, Doc himself, the creator, um, Michael from Vapor Lick. We got Owen Ginter and Kevin Vape. So right now we have eight participants that we know of. There's a couple other people that have the, have the juice already. They might end up being on the show. So there's at least eight people. So <clears throat> now let's get into some of the other inners. 
for during the show for every ten dollars that gets raised anybody that's in the chat that donates at least ten dollars <throat> you can have your choice of any person that's on the that's in participating into this you can say i'm donating ten dollars i want tommy to take an extra vape for every ten dollars is an extra vape so if you donate twenty dollars, you could say I want Tommy to do twenty, you know, or two extra vapes, or I want Michael to do one, and I want Nikki B to do one. So you get the idea of how that goes. If I got, I want to donate fifty dollars, I want Doc, Tommy, Nikki, Michael, and Lemmy all to do one vape extra after they do their ten. So you can raise a little bit more money, and you could possibly make us puke our guts out. <clears throat> Let's take it another step further. Over at um, vapeandswag.com, Vaporlick has t-shirts that say Vaporlick, and it's got his logo with the smiley face with the tongue hanging out. He's also got sweatshirts over there. He's got hoodies over there. But he's got t-shirts over there for men and women that uh, Shane has created with him. And as it is right now, portions of that is goes to not blowing smoke already so when you purchase that shirt even without this challenge portions of that already goes to not blowing smoke so thank you shane and thank you michael that's totally awesome during the show if you go over and buy either the men's shirt women's shirt you know you want to buy one for each of you for every shirt that is purchased it's going to count as two extra vapes so if you buy yourself a shirt and you buy your significant other another uh, a shirt that would constitute as four extra vapes that you could have one one person two people four people on the panel they have to do because you bought those four slots so again it gets it gets a little bit better now if you go over to adoreeliquid.com during the month of march strawberry submission is the flavor of the month that 50 percent of all proceeds of that flavor whether it be your juice or concentrates goes to not blowing smoke. So, during the show, if you buy a 30 milliliter bottle, which is I think 12.99, that's going to constitute as one extra vape that someone has to do. If you buy the 30 milliliter bottle of the concentrate, that's going to constitute as two extra vapes for someone to have to do or two people to do one. You buy the 120, that's going to constitute is three extra vapes for someone to do. Now, during the show and only during the show, all strawberry submission sales during the show time, 100% of those sales are going to not blowing smoke. How cool is that? So Dawn is already doing 50%. But during the show, she's taken that 50% and doubling it. Just for that window of the show time. For, so be out there. Get yourself some awesome juice. You need juice anyways. And it's going to a good cause at the same time. How cool is that? So kind of a little bit of a rundown. And like I said, it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm wearing a garbage bag to protect myself. Because I don't want to really puke on myself. And I can anticipate myself going to have to. But it's all in for a good cause. So, again, let's have some fun. Let's raise some money. It's awesome. I'm going to leave everybody's link down below. And I'm going to leave the, a link down below also for where, where Nikki B had the challenge over on her channel. Um, you can get a better idea as with, of it as well. But all that will be all down below. So, like I said, if you guys could just, after this video, you want to share it. Let's bring more and more people over there. Let's just have some fun for a couple of hours and see how many people we can get to puke. All right, that's going to do it, folks. Thank you for joining me, and uh, we'll see you guys during the week, and we'll definitely see you Friday night. Thank you again. Love you all. And so until the next time, I lost my train of thought. Keep vaping. <laughs>